Hello everyone, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'm Arif, your financial freedom journey partner. Today we're gonna talk about uh, Warren Buffett. Yes, you heard it right, the Oracle of Ohama. So we're gonna dive into the strategies that he followed for investment. So whenever we are talking about uh, investor, successful investor, then the only one name always comes to our mind that is Warren Buffett. He's a truly genius. In today's video, I'm going to talk about uh, the key principle that he always followed for his investment. Uh, so if we follow that, definitely we'll be a successful investor because uh, we already seen what uh, can we achieve in one lifetime if we look into Warren Buffett's life. So before we start the video and talk about the investment strategies, uh, first let's uh, know better Warren Buffett, the legend. So he was born in 1930 and he's the chairman and CEO of uh, Berkshire Hathaway. So, uh, and now his net worth is more than a billion dollars. You heard it right. And he made all of this money from the stock market. So if we follow his principles, we're gonna make a lot of money, that's for sure. So the first uh, key principle is uh, the principle of value investing. So what do we mean by that? Well, that means that we need to find companies which are uh, undervalued, but they have very strong uh, fundamentals and uh, they have the potential to grow in future. So uh, there is a famous saying from Warren Buffett is that price is what you pay and value is what you get. So we need to be sure that uh, whatever company that we are investing in, it should be for the long term. We need to know the fundamentals. We need to find an attractive price where we can enter to this uh, market and we need to hold for a long term. That's how Warren Buffett became Warren Buffett today. Key principle two is uh, invest in only what you understand. So. Uh, it's uh, not always a very good decision that uh, uh, to invest whatever people are saying this is going to be the next hot stuff. Don't do that because you don't know the fundamentals. You don't know the company or the industry very well. So what he suggested is that if you're good in one particular field, for instance, I'm from a computer background, so I know uh, tech stocks well because I know the fundamentals, which companies are doing good, which companies are gonna go up in future. So I do have that sort of understanding. So for that reason, I should only invest in tech stocks because that makes more sense. Then I can make more uh, better decisions in the long term because now I know the fundamentals, I know the futures, I can predict it, even though I'm not 100% sure, but I can predict it better because I do have the understanding. So always try to find one specific sector that you are good at. That can be anything. That could be any financial sector. That could be any tech sector. It depends person to person because your skill sets is different than mine. So that's how we should pick a stock. And once we pick the stock, then we need to hold it for, for a very, very long time. Warren Buffett's key principle number three is patience and long-term thinking. So uh, whenever we are... Uh, buying some stocks we need to think it like we are becoming a part owner of that particular company and uh, if we believe in the fundamentals of the company the company will do good in future so for that reason uh, if we want to, our money to grow we need to give it time we need to hold it for a uh, many many years even if you see warren buffett's portfolio his stock portfolio he hold a holds the stock for a very 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 long time because he believes in this company so first you need to do your uh, due diligence and you need to check like you need to be 100 percent certain that you are picking the good stock once you are sure about it and buy it and hold it for the long term if you do that you will become very very wealthy so remember stock market is not like a sprint it's more of a like marathon key principle number four is uh, quality over quantity so uh, when we say that that means uh, we need to find a company that would be a winner in the long term. We, the company should have a very strong fundamentals. It should have the competitive advantage so that in future it's going to grow. Uh, once uh, Warren Buffett said, it's a very good deal to buy a wonderful company at a fair price than a fair company uh, at a wonderful price. That means that we always have to think about the quality, not the quantity. Because the company, if the company is a very good company, the fundamentals are very clear and strong. In future, it will help you to generate a lot of money. So for that reason, always prefer quality over quantity. Key principle number five is uh, 
be fearful when others are greedy and be greedy when others are fearful so that means we shouldn't follow the crowd or shouldn't follow the current market pattern and make decision if we believe in the fundamentals or a company that it will do good in future we should invest in even if it seems like uh, at the current state it's uh, struggling but we know that uh, it has a very strong backbone so if we make decision like this you will make a lot of money from the stock market because here you are taking a calculative risk and uh, you will get the reward for it so whenever you feel like yes the market is going down for a certain company so what i do basically I made a watch list, maybe like I'm uh, looking at 25 stocks or companies every day. If I find that someday the company share price drop for some reason, I will buy more and more of that company, particular company, because I know in the long term, I'm going to make a lot of money out of it because the company has a potential to grow a lot. So for that reason, just wait for the perfect moment. And once you have it, then you should go after it. And here you have it, the Warren Buffett way. Congratulations guys for reaching this far of this video. So remember, investments is a journey, so we have to be knowledgeable for it. So you have to spend time. So whenever you get time every day, at least spend half an hour to learn about uh, finance, learn about the stock market, and uh, it will help you in the long run because uh, even though the uh, time is different, the fundamentals, the basic of investment is uh, the same. The thing that I mentioned is still it's quite relevant in today's uh, stock market. Thank you so much guys for watching my videos. It means a lot to me. Uh, if you found this video helpful, please uh, like and subscribe to my channel because I'm planning to upload more of this kind of video in future. If you want uh, me to cover any specific stock, just let me know in this comment section and I'll do a complete breakdown of that particular stock. Uh, thank you guys again and have a great and wonderful day.